Hello Scorpio, welcome. I'm Ryan, and thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading, so of course everything may not resonate. Take what does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, please check out my wife's channel. It'll probably be 3 tarot, which should read for you as well. Thank you. <laughs> oh wow i felt it i felt it scorpio um what's this about what's this about there you are you're like it's about me okay a uh, good roll today huh um, I should say you're you're starting off on a high note. Be responsible with whatever habits, routines, rituals you do. Oh, that one got you a little bit. Huh? That one got you a little bit. Well, don't let me throw you off. Okay. Ain't that something? Ain't that something? Jumping into the Scorpio. This is interesting. Um, I'm, I'm kind of like in this playful energy with you a little bit because you're showing me like right away, like I'm, I hear someone being like, I'm stoked. I'm stoked. It's like, okay, okay. You're, you're stoked, Scorpio. Um, you're stoked and you're happy and you're excited to collaborate or work with someone. This is an energy of like, I, I can't even contain it. I can't even, you know, get the energy off my face, even if I tried. Um, things between you and this person, whoever this connection is, collaboratively speaking, things are moving fast. And I mean fast. It seems to feel like the two of you definitely have their, your, you know, your plans of your own. You both are showing up. And even though this is about you, I'll kind of make it about both of you because you wanted to, you know, present it in such a way where I'm like, okay, we'll, we'll play that game. Um, you guys are right next to each other. In a sense where you're feeling their vibe, they're feeling your vibe. Um, and I'm not too sure exactly what's going on, but I feel like as things are progressing moving forward with the both of you, you're having a little bit of a realization here. I'm not too sure exactly what this realization is. Um, but you're having the realization of, I think this is more than passion. I think this is more than lust and temptation. And so it starts off as a collaborative energy, but then it turns into something more. And you're kind of like saying, well, actually, do I keep this more so about business and work? Or is this actually like some sort of connection or new love or new relationship forming? Whatever this is. Um, it's interesting because for a very split second, it almost seems it feels like you're trying to figure out how to turn this passion into a relationship or a connection at the same time because of the temptation of the passion between the two of you you're actually confused as to what to think about all this and so you're kind of in a sense you're kind of spinning here um you're spinning it's like you want to move forward at the same time it's kind of like i just don't know all right, once again i appreciate the directness what you're saying is whoever this cheese louise scorpio just out with it it's fine. It's fine. I'm not saying it's like it's a bad thing. I'm just like, you're like, yeah, you just, you just want. <laughs> you're just like, I want to know. It's like, there's nothing wrong with you, There's nothing wrong with it. I'm just like, goodness gracious. I'll let you know. It's, it's just like. <laughs> Funny, funny energy. It's all good though. It's all good. You know, I'd rather have a little bit of playful energy rather than 
someone who's like, I'll start off playful, and then all of a sudden, you know, it's like feelings or something get hurt, or it's like, you stepped on my toes. It's like, you're going to bring that energy, bring that energy, but then don't just kind of take it some other type of way. It's like, know what you're kind of walking into here. Um, yeah, this is, you're, geez Louise, Scorpio, you're trying to create, you're trying to create, how do I say this? You're trying to create a relationship or a partnership, romantically speaking, between you and someone from your past that you have a lot of history with, but you're kind of like, I have a history with them, and I'm, I gotta say it, I gotta go there. I'm so very physically attracted to them that all I just want to know is, do they care? Do they have emotions? Do they have feelings for me? Because if so, it, geez, this is almost like, uh, what are those things? It's like those video, or not those, um, those old school childhood games. The, what was it called? The uh, phone line game? Mm -hmm. to the telephone where, like, where they sit there and they talk to each other it's like so tell me then what happened then what happened then what happened oh the little so the little yeah there's a little, <laughs> is it the screen or is it through the cup i forget the cup the <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's like so so tell me what next what next what next what about this what about this what about that with them um Someone cares. I'll say it that way. Someone cares. Someone does. At the same time, I, I feel like this is you, Scorpio. I feel like you care. And at the same time, you're kind of trying to really determine and figure out, like, how much you care. How much you kind of, like, in a sense, want or desire them. Um, how happy they truly make you. Excuse me. And initially, it does show up that you, you are happy. You are fulfilled with how things are going at the same time. Again, there's like this energy of, um, for some reason, I don't know what that's about. It seems and feels like you become a little bit guarded the longer you sit with that energy or that emotion. I don't know if that's because it seems and feels like this, this connection or relationship or possible new love isn't like flourishing or going any further. I don't know what that's about. Um, but it seems like whatever this, in a sense, quote, dance around this situation, this connection that you're doing with them. Um, the longer that it takes place, unfortunately, the colder the connection becomes. And I feel like as you sit with this and realize, like, mm, something's just not working out. And I don't exactly know what that's about. Um, but like I said, it's like it starts off so very hot and passionate and fiery and then it's like, could this actually be the one? Could this actually turn into something more of a deeper relationship or deeper connection? And then I feel like as you're moving forward and it's like, as time moves on, it's kind of like um, that fire is just slowly fading and fizzling out. Um, and you're having that unfortunate realization of like, was it just a fling? Was it just temptation? I don't know. Um, but there is that unfortunate realization once again as to what this actually truly was. Like I said, it starts off with a lot of passion and hopes for something more and then kind of turns out the way it does. But of course, if you are dealing with anyone, you could be dealing with an air sign, an earth sign, a water sign, or a fire sign. They're all here. Goodbye.